Welcome back to the American Dream. My next guest is Tommy Pastana. He's a top producing listing specialist with Coldwell Banker and no stranger to this show. And he brought along a very special guest with him today, Roger Serra's owner of Urban Buggy. Gentlemen, thank you so much for being on the American Dream today. Thanks thank for you. having us. So, Tommy, I want to begin by talking with you. You've come up with a fantastic promotion. I think it's so creative. You actually offer a free golf cart with a home purchase for your clients who purchase a home in the Trophy Club area. How did you come up with this idea? Well, it, it all started a few months ago. You know, the market here in DFW has been fantastic over the last few years. Well, we've seen a slight correction, and um, homes are starting to sit. So you're starting to see a little more inventory. So Trophy Club was a great pilot program for me because it's a golf cart community. Um, so I got with Roger and I was saying, hey, how can I add more value to my listings in Trophy Club? So we worked out a program to where if a buyer comes to one of my listings and they purchase a home in Trophy Club, I'm going to provide them with a free golf cart. So uh, we're real excited about it. We just kicked it off. And um, so far, it's going great. I love this idea. So, Roger, as the owner of Urban Buggy, tell me a little bit more about the company. How did you come up with the idea? Yeah, so we started with just kind of taking these golf carts, right? And, and everybody knows what a golf cart is. But, you know, after you look into this and you start seeing what we do these things, I mean, they're, they're, they're incredible, right? So, you know, you started with one customer wanted to have some sound on it. And then this customer wanted to have a little lift kit. This customer wanted to have these accessories, LED lights, underglow lights, and they just almost become like party machines. <laughs> and um, they're great for communities and neighborhoods. And parents have just all of a sudden just started to adopt them. They, uh, the moms are taking the kids to school. The families are taking the kids out to the pools. And slowly but surely, it seems like every single person that does one sees the last one and wants to do more to it. So it's slowly just evolved itself over the several years that we've been doing it, and it's just been a great business for us. We have a lot of fun with it. I love this. You're customizing it. And you mentioned moms and kids. So this isn't just for golfers. Right, exactly. So what's interesting is people come see us, and they're like, well, I don't really play golf. And I'm like, that's okay. Actually, really nobody who buys these things do them just to play golf in, right? They're just using them for the communities. Um, and what we've seen here in the Metroplex and maybe other areas for that matter too, because we do ship these things all over the United States. Um, they've gone, you know, to the islands of Jamaica. We sh ship a couple to the Cayman Islands. Wow. Um, we've got a couple going to Michigan next week. But what's happening is these communities and these areas that we're living in are kind of uh, building out these master plan communities, if you will. And inside those, there's schools and there's neighborhood pools and they have clubhouses. And so these are the type of communities that really are just grabbing these things. And, you know, it's a lifestyle for them, right? So, and they don't want just a golf cart. They want an urban buggy, you know? They want it tricked out with all the bells and whistles. And they want to take their kid to the, to the next door neighbors and drop them off on the weekends in the golf cart and go to the pool and in the school. And so it's just really a lifestyle push that, you know, people have really been adopting to and love it. This isn't just taking off in the Dallas-Fort Worth area. This is really taking off across the country. And you even mentioned really globally, worldwide. Why do you think right. this is so appealing for people? You know, I, I think what people are looking for is, you know, when they're at home in their environments, they're looking for fun, right? I mean, we have these nice homes, we have these beautiful things that we do, but at the end of the day, too, people want to get outside, right? And so what they found is, you know, they want to run over to the neighbors for the weekend and have a barbecue, right? They want to go to that pool we talked about. Um, and so they're using these things just kind of, they want to park the car on the weekend. They want a destination place, which is their home, right? But at the same time, they don't want to go out into the mucks that they've had all week and fight the crowds and the things like that. They just want to take the cart out, maybe grab their, their beverage of choice, if you will, cruise around the neighborhood with their family <laughs> and friends. And, um, and, and have an enjoyable time together. I just think it's such a fantastic idea. I love the creativity behind this. Tommy, you actually have a listing today that you wanted to highlight, and it really piggybacks on the idea of having a home where you also can play, where things are walkable, where you can go out on the weekends, you can walk to restaurants and things of that nature. Tell me a little bit about this property. Exactly, we are so excited about this one. We actually hit the market this morning. It is located at 5626 Mattelie Avenue in what we call the M Streets of Dallas, very popular area, close to Lower Greenville, Greenville Avenue. You can walk to the Granada Theater, which if you live in Dallas, it is very, very popular. Restaurants, 
bars, shopping, you name it, and you're within a few minutes of downtown Dallas. So, so we hit the market this morning. We're listed at 574.9. Um, so it's a duplex, three bedroom, two and a half baths. And in that price point, I don't expect it to last long at all. I was just gonna say, I think that one's gonna go quickly. Gentlemen, thank you so much for being on the show today. Yeah, absolutely. Thanks thank for you. having us. And we'll be right back with more of the American Dream.